Hi everyone, Aiden here at The Trailer. Today we're going to be taking a look at this Gladiator Utility Cargo Net. This one is going to be designed to use on your utility trailers or maybe some large flatbed trucks. Overall size is going to be 9 feet and 3.5 and inches long and then 7 feet and 3.5 and inches wide. These come in a variety of different sizes, both smaller, maybe for more truck bed applications, and much, much larger for even larger trailers. This is just to give you a size reference, but let's check it out. On our trailer today, we're using this with seven different pallets stacked up at various heights, and one of the large racks that we use for our hitch comparison videos. This is just to give you an idea of what this would look like with a load that has varied height and odd shapes and sizes. We've got this pulled over a hard edge up top to see how the material handles those hard edges. But what I really want to see is how well does it work. So coming to the rack, I'm going to shake it around and I can easily move the whole trailer. Everything's really solid and nothing's shifting around. It comes included with four really heavy duty cam buckle straps that we've got set up at each corner. And what this is doing is actually wrapping around the tall point of the trailer and applying a lot of downward pressure that keeps this surprisingly still. And what that does also, even though it's maybe a little bit loose on the sides here, the pallets underneath are still very tight as well. I can grab it by the pallet and again, shake the whole trailer around and nothing's shifting or moving. So for this specific application, I'd say we're looking pretty good depending on the height of the load you're carrying, because let's face it, this one isn't too tall, really. It's just that rack that sticks up a little bit tall. But if you've got something that's pretty high up throughout the entirety of the trailer, I'd maybe look into something that's maybe a little bit oversized compared to what you think you need. That way it can drape down over the sides of the load and you can reach down to those tie down points. Whatever net you end up going with, they all have tons of different tie downs. This particular size has 52 of these metal reinforced grommets that we can hook our cam buckle straps into. So they go all along the outside edge, all along the middle part where the mesh starts. And then we've even got some that are sewn inset here. And that's actually where we have our cam buckle straps at now is each corner at the furthest inset hole. Any sort of strap will do to add as extra tie down points around the net but you can pick up some from Gladiator as well. You can have the S-hook variant that comes in a kit of two or get that coated double J variant also in a kit of two that will match the straps that already come with the net. As far as material goes, the Gladiator net is very nice. The webbing is an inch and a half wide with reinforced stitching all throughout. It feels very durable, very high quality and the mesh in the middle of the webbing also feels really good. It's a pretty thick, material it's got a good coating on there and we've got it pulled over a pretty rough corner of metal right here and it's not showing any sorts of signs of fraying or tearing and that's with a lot of pressure on there so for me i'm not too worried about it wearing down over time as far as the weight capacity goes the cargo net itself is going to have a safe working load limit of 1500 pounds and a brake strength of 4500 pounds and the cam buckle straps that come with it they have a safe working load limit of 1,323 pounds with a brake strength of 3,969 pounds. The straps are gonna be an inch and a half wide, just like the net, and they're gonna be 34 inches long. So if you need more than that to reach the tie down points on your trailer, just keep that in mind that you may need to pick up longer straps. But in most cases, because there's so many different metal grommets around here to choose from, you can find one that fits. The net also comes with a carrying case that has a really well reinforced handle, makes it really easy to carry it around. The large zipper pocket at the front has tons of room inside to keep the net. It's really easy to fold up and get back in there. And there's plenty of room inside here for the straps as well. If you decide to add extra straps to your kit and you want to keep them separate from the net, there's the pocket in the front that you can choose from. You've got two pockets in the back as well as a zippered pocket back here that you can put some stuff in. So if you've got bungee cords, other straps, anything that you wanna use when you're tying things down, it can all live in here and it's a really good quality bag too. One other thing you might consider if you like this style of net but you're not too sure about the material is that Gladiator does have a version that's a water resistant material. So you can get a large one of those. It's gonna have all the same nice tie down points, but give you a water resistant material to drape over whatever you're carrying. So if you're using your trailer to maybe transport furniture or any other things that you wanna keep out of the rain and elements, 
that might be a nice thing to consider. If this size is about what you're looking for, but you think you need something a little bit different, you could size down to the version of this that's six feet and nine inches wide and eight feet long. Just a little bit smaller than what you're looking at right here. Or you can size up. You can get that seven foot, three and a half inches wide, the same width as this one here, but it's gonna be a few feet longer with 13 feet and three and a half inches of length. Overall, I think the net is a really nice addition to the trailer. It works well as a sort of one-stop shop solution to getting all this stuff tied down and secured on the trailer. Sure, it's not making complete contact with everything on here, but none of this is really shifting around. It's putting a lot of even pressure over the varied load and all the straps that it come with is really nice. I think you could certainly add ratchet straps or other things to your trailer like this one does to have sort of dedicated tie down points and supplemental security just to maybe run over the top of these pallets at the front that isn't super well covered. But as a sort of starting point, I think the net works really well. It's a really great quality and everything's pretty secure. And that was our look at this Gladiator utility cargo net for your trailers. Thanks for watching.